When John Paul Jones was a little boy, he pointed to the sea. Said, when I get to be a man, a fighting man I'll be. I'll leave my mark on the ocean and my name in history. When John Paul was a member of the British Admiralty, he killed a sailor on his ship, which was a crime, you see. He changed his name to J.P. Jones and came to America. He fought in the rain and he fought in the sun and he fought in the moonlight too. He fought with his knife and he fought with his gun and he fought till his blood ran blue. But John Paul Jones was a fighting man, a fighting man was he. He sailed to the east and he sailed to the west and he helped set America free. When John Paul was a captain in the U.S. Naval Band, a fighting for the glory and the freedom of our land. He made those British captains wish that they were on dry land. He sent their mighty vessels to the bottom of the sea. He took their bags of treasure and he sank their chest of tea. He gave his blood for all free men and his life for liberty. He fought in the rain and he fought in the sun and he fought in the moonlight too. John Paul Jones was a fighting man, a fighting man was he. He sailed to the east and he sailed to the west and he helped set America free. He fought in the rain and he fought in the sun and he fought in the moonlight too. He fought with his knife and he fought with his gun and he fought till his blood ran through. John Paul Jones was a fighting man, a fighting man was he. He sailed to the and he sailed through the West and he helped set America free. We took a little bacon and we took a little beans And we caught the bloody British in a town in New Orleans We fired our guns and the British kept a coming There wasn't as many as there was a while ago We fired once more and they began to run it On down the Mississippi to the Gulf of Mexico We looked down the river and we see the British come And there must have been a hundred of them beating on the drum They stepped so high and they made the bugles ring We stood beside our cotton bales and didn't say a thing Fired our guns and the British kept a coming. There wasn't as many as there was a while ago. We fired once more and they began to run it on down the Mississippi to the Gulf of Mexico. Old Hickory said we could take them by surprise if we didn't fire muskets till we looked them in the eye. We held our fire till we see their faces well. Then we opened up our squirrel guns and really gave them well. We fired our guns and the British kept a coming. There wasn't as many as there was a while ago. We fired once more and they began to run it well, down the Mississippi to the Gulf of Mexico. Then they ran through the briars and they ran through the brambles and they ran through the bushes where a rabbit couldn't go. They ran so fast that the hounds couldn't catch it well, down the Mississippi to the Gulf of Mexico. We fired our cannon till the barrel melted down so we grabbed an alligator and we fought another round. We filled his head with cannonballs and powdered his behind. And when we touched the powder off, the gator lost his mind. We fired our guns and the British kept a coming. There wasn't as many as there was a while ago. We fired once more and they began to run it. On down the Mississippi to the Gulf of Mexico. Yeah, they ran through the briars and they ran through the brambles and they ran through the bushes where a rabbit couldn't go. They ran so fast that the hounds couldn't catch them. On down the Mississippi to the Gulf of Mexico.
In the southern part of Texas, in the town of San Antonio, is a fortress all in ruins that the weeds have overgrown. You may look in vain for crosses and you'll never see a one, but sometimes between the setting and the rising of the sun, you can hear a ghostly bugle as the men go marching by. You can hear them as the answer to that roll call in the sky. Colonel Travis, Davy Crockett, and 180 more. Captain Dickinson, Jim Bowie, present and accounted for. Back in 1836, Houston said to Travis, Get some volunteers and go. Fortify the Alamo Well, the men came from Texas And from old Tennessee And they joined up with Travis Just to fight for the right to be free Indian scouts with squirrel guns Men with muzzle loaders Stood together, heel and toe To defend the Alamo You may ne'er see your loved ones Travis told them that day Those who want to can leave now Those who fight to the death let them stay In the sand he drew a line With his army saber Out of 185 Not a soldier crossed the line With his banners a-dancing In the dawn's golden light Santa Anna came prancing On a horse that was black as the night Sent an officer to tell Travis to surrender Travis answered with a shell And a rousing rebel yell Santa Anna turned scarlet Played to quay low, he roared I will show them no quarter Everyone will be put to the sword 185 holding back 5,000 Five days, six days, eight days, ten Travis held and held again Then he sent for replacements For his wounded and lame But the troops that were coming Never came, never came, never came Twice he charged, then blew recall On the fatal third time Santa Anna breached the wall And he killed them one and all Now the bugles are silent And there's rust on each sword And the small band of soldiers Lie asleep in the arms of the Lord In the southern part of Texas Near the town of San Antonio Like a statue on his pintle Rides a cowboy all alone and he sees the cattle grazing where a century before Santa and his guns were blazing and the cannons used to roar And his eyes turn sort of misty and his heart begins to glow And he takes his hat off slowly to the men of Alamo To the thirteen days of glory at the siege of Alamo. The sun shone bright and clear that day. We all left Washington. To lick the rebel boys in gray at the Battle of Bull Run. They came from Pennsylvania, and some from Maryland, to see the rebel boys get spanked by Honest Abe's broad hand. We said we'll run them to Atlanta and to Galveston Bay, but they ran us back to Washington, Philadelphia, and Philadelphia. The ladies wore their brightest shawls, the gentlemen were gay. They came to see their Yankee boys with old Virginia eye. I held my mama's hand and skipped when a soldier said to me, Would you rather have Jeff Davis hat or the sword of Bobby Lee? We said we'll run them to Atlanta and to Galveston Bay. But they ran us back to Washington and Philadelphia, and Philadelphia. And then the 
general dubbed his head and said, let's rest the spell. And for the first time we all heard that awful rebel yell. Waters of Manassas Creek became a ruby red. And many a rib and Yankee boy lay in the willows dead. We said we'll run on to Atlanta and to Galveston Bay. But they run us back to Washington and Philadelphia and Philadelphia. A fight locked in the chest of time, too horrible to tell. Virginia's cool green countryside became a lake of hell. Don't count your chicks before they're hatched or you work until it's done. Remember, yes, remember long the Battle of Bull Run. We'll run on to Atlanta and to Galveston Bay. But they ran us back to Washington and Philadelphia and Philadelphia. Steers and shells as big as trees. Out of the cold and foggy night came the British ship, the Hood. And every British seaman he knew and understood. They had to sink the Bismarck, the terror of the sea. Stop those guns as big as steers and those shells as big as trees. We find that German battleship that's making such a fuss. We gotta sink the Bismarck, cause the world depends on us. He hit the decks are running, boys, and spin those guns around. But when we find the Bismarck, we gotta cut her down. The hood found the Bismarck, and on that fatal day, the Bismarck started firing 15 miles away. We gotta sink the Bismarck, was the battle sound. But when the smoke had cleared away, the mighty hood went down. For six long days and weary nights, they tried to find her trail. Churchill told the people, put every ship a sail. Cause somewhere on that ocean, I know she's gotta be. We gotta sink the Bismarck to the bottom of the sea. They find that German battleship that's making such a fuss. We gotta sink the Bismarck cause the world depends on us. They hit the decks are running boys and spin those guns around. When we find the Bismarck, we gotta cut her down. The fog was gone the seventh day, and they saw the morning sun. Ten hours away from homeland, the Bismarck made its run. The admiral of the British fleet said, turn those bows around. We found that German battleship, and we're gonna cut her down. The British guns were aimed and the shells were coming fast. The first shell hit the Bismarck, they knew she couldn't last. That mighty German battleship is just a memory. Sink the Bismarck was the battle cry that shook the seven seas. We found that German battleship was making such a fuss. We had to sink the Bismarck cause the world depends on us. We hit the deck running and we spun those guns around, yeah. That mighty Bismarck and we had to cut her down We found that German battleship for making such a fuss We had to sink the Bismarck cause the world depends on us We hit the deck running and we spun those guns around We found that mighty Bismarck and then we cut her down October 31st, 1941, the United States destroyer Reuben James, sailing in the waters west of Iceland, was attacked, torpedoed, and sunk without warning. Ninety-five lives were lost in this, the first U.S. warship to go down in the Second World War. Have you heard of that ship called the good Reuben James? 
Fanned by hard fighting men, both of honor and fame. She flew the stars and stripes of the land of the free, but tonight she's in her grave on the bottom of the sea. Tell me what were their names, tell me what were their names, did you have a friend on the good Reuben James? What were their names, tell me what were their names, the men that went down on the good Reuben James? Well, a hundred men went down in that dark, watery grave. When that good ship went down, only forty-four were saved. Twas the last day of October, we saved the forty-four. From the cold ocean waters of that cold, icy shore. Tell me what was their names, tell me what was their names. You have a friend on that good roof and James. What was their names? Tell me what was their names. You have a friend on that good roof and James. It was there in the dark of that uncertain night that we watched for the U boats and waited for the fight. Then a wine and a rock and a great explosion. Tonight there are lights in our country so bright In the farms and the cities they are telling of this fight And now the mighty battleships will steam the bounding main And remember the name of that good Reuben James Tell me what were their names, tell me what were their names Did you have a friend on the good Reuben James what were their names? Tell me what were their names? Did you have a friend on the good Reuben James? Many years have passed since those brave men are gone And those cold ocean waters now are still and they're calm Well, many years have passed, but still I wonder why The worst of men must fight and the best of men must die Tell me what was their names, tell me what was their names Did you have a friend on that good Reuben James? Tell me what were their names What were their names? Tell me what were their names? Did you have a friend on the good Reuben James? What were their names? Tell me what were their names? The men that went down on the good Reuben James. Fighting soldiers from the sky. Fearless men who jump and die Men who mean just what they say The brave men of the Green Beret Silver wings upon their chest These are men, America's best One hundred men will test today but only three in the Green Beret Trained to live off nature's land Trained in combat hand to hand Men who fight by night and day Courage take from the Green Beret 
upon their chest. These are men, America's best. One hundred men will test today, but only three win the Green Beret. Back at home, a young wife waits. Her Green Beret has met his fate. He has died for those oppressed, leaving her this last request. Put silver wings on my son's chest. Make him one of America's best. He'll be a man. They'll test one day. Have him win.
8th of November He left South Dakota to fight for the red, white, and blue. He was 19 and green with a new M16, just doing what he had to do.
There's a place called Darnang Village Across the ocean, far away In deep concern for one young woman That's where I abide today Today I got a dear John letter From that young woman in the USA When I was called I knew I'd lose her It don't matter anyway There are girls in Saigon City Waiting there with open arms On my leave I may go see them In this other world called Vietnam Stateside girl should take this warning Be ye faithful Cause you can't tell On the streets of Saigon City They have many things to sell There are girls in Saigon City Waiting there with open arms On my lead I may go see them In this other world called thee